Hey, it's I don't know what's Orson. This is my free to play cooking guide. So in this video, I'll show you two main ways to train cooking, and the first one is the most popular one. Uh, it's cooking fish. With this series of methods, you can expect to get level 99 cooking in 70 hours. And you will even make money, 3 million GP overall. Okay, so this is what you will cook. So first of all, sardine, herring, mercurial, trout, pike, salmon to level 60. From level 60 to 74, it's tuna. And finally, all the way to level 99, it's lobsters, which stop at around 200k experience per hour, which is really fast, especially for free to play players. The other way to train cooking, which is way faster but also way more expensive, is to make wine. So you can expect to get 700k experience per hour, which is the fastest experience of the game in cooking, at a cost of around 4.6 GP per experience. So that means level 99 in cooking should only take you 20 hours, at a cost of around 60 million GPs. Now let's talk about a few things that will influence the amount of experience you will get in cooking. And the first thing is urns. They are really, really important when cooking because they will give 20% bonus experience in cooking, which is a lot. Uh, the only thing you will need is level 2 crafting uh, for the cheapest urns, but for the best one, you will need level 36 crafting for free to play players. So yeah, they give 20% bonus experience and how to make them, it's very simple. You buy the urn unfinished on the Grand Exchange and then you simply add a fire room. So yeah, to use them, simply add them in your inventory and every time you will cook a fish, a little part of the fish will go in the urn and when it's full, simply click on it to get bonus experience. Um, so yeah, it's kind of tricky for free to play players because the best fish they can cook is swordfish that give 140 experience but you cannot use urn with swordfish uh, because you don't have access to strong urns when you are free to play players. While in the other end there is the lobster uh, that can be used with urns that will give you 144 experience. So even if the swordfish is in theory better, uh, because you cannot use urns with it, that's why I recommend to cook lobsters. Another important thing is bonfire, because you will get a bonus experience of 10% in cooking if you cook on a fire that was made by a player. So it's a really big bonus, I really recommend to use it. And unlike fire making, the bonus doesn't depend on the amount of players that is currently cooking on the fire. Okay, so now we'll talk more in detail about the fish method. So if you do remember, there is all the different fish at all the different level um, on the screen right now. Uh, you can start cooking tuna at level 30 and lobster at level 40, but I really don't recommend it because you will burn a lot of them, lose a lot of cash and not get the maximum experience rate. You can expect to cook about 1250 fish per hour and you will also get a bonus of 20% from the urns and 10% from the bonfire. So with lobster you can expect to get up to 200k experience per hour. And the system for cooking fish is very simple. You have a raw fish, uh, you use it on a fire and you get a cooked fish. You can train cooking pretty much everywhere in RuneScape near a bank, but I recommend to go to the Grand Exchange because there are tons of players that is training um, fire making so there is already a bonfire ready for you. This is how your inventory should look. So first of all, your two best urns, uh, so probably regular cooking urns and the rest will be raw fish. Okay, so simply use your raw fish on the bonfire and press the cook option and that's it. You simply wait 45 seconds and get experience. So as you can see it's really simple and really away from keyboard. Um, I recommend to go to the Grand Exchange like I've said earlier because there are tons of players as you can see on the screen that are currently training uh, fire making. But you could also train at any bank and make your own bonfire. When your inventory is all cooked you simply bank so you drop all the cooked fish in your inventory and withdraw more raw fish that you will use on the bonfire. Press the cook option and wait another 45 seconds. 
The next method I will talk about is wine. So you can start making them at level 35 all the way to level 99 and to make them you will need a jug of water and grape and by combining those two items you will get a jug of wine. So yeah, you can expect to get 700k experience per hour, which is amazing at a cost of 4.6 GP per experience. So yeah, this is how your inventory should look. So half your inventory will be grapes and the other half will be jug of water. Don't forget that you cannot use urns with wines. Okay, so first of all, use your grape on the jug of water, select the brew option and that's pretty much it. So it's, they are way faster to make, it's only like one second per wine, so it's with faster experience. And when your inventory is all done, you simply withdraw more grapes and more jug of water and do exactly the same thing. So use one of the other and select the brew option. You won't actually get the experience instantly, uh, you actually need to stop training for like a couple of seconds and then you will get a big bunch of experience. I know it's strange, but that's how it works.